Welcome to Charlotte Motor Speedway for the 24th race of the season. Wow, I expected to, to use this track for the big for since like the beginning, first couple of races. But late into the season is our 24th race here at Charlotte, so you know it's kind of weird, I know. But uh, there is a zero, one of the championship contenders sitting in second. And where's the 16 sit out? All the way at the back. She really got to work it tonight. She really wants to hang on to that points lead. Back to the front. About to get the command. Here it is. Alright, here we go. Feeling's rolling off. Should be a good night of racing. Should be fun. Um, might have, have one car stalled or something. No, uh, actually no. But Will Burns in the two. Uh, looks like he's heading down pit road already. He had to cross the line at 20, being held back by him, and now he goes down. Here we go, coming to the green. Green flags out. Here we go. Good start for Sam Rogers. Crossed the line first, but of course that won't count as a lap lead. It's just, you know, got a better restart. And whoa, look at the zero. Almost got turned by Kevin Carter coming off turn two. Yes, Kevin Carter, okay. Side by side, all the way through. No three wide racing just yet. They're really going at it hard. Look at the front. Whoa, a couple cars were grambling. Whoa, there goes the four. He's around. The one right in front of traffic. Oh my god. A couple more others. Caution is out. We do not race back. I think there's more. Whoa, the 21. Mason Powers almost went upside down. I think he did went upside down. And he's trying to move. Nah, he's done. He's done. Caution is out. Chris Kyle, the leader. We'll take a look at the replay. Watch Orius in the number four car. I don't know if he went down to the apron or he just got forced down there. The 43 got some as well. Look at the contact up front as well. But of course, Orius' first car to spin around. Then it was the one who came right in front of traffic and pretty much took out the others. Not of not much of a big wreck though. 16 Nick Purcells. That's not what he needed. Watch Mason Powers. He almost gets. He almost went upside down, and right there, that's the big hit. Look at that, and almost went fully over and back on those wheels. And John Magna Jr. got a lot of damage from that. But I don't know why the 21 can't move. I've seen drivers hit even harder, and they could still drive that thing. But it's not for Mason Powers, I guess. We'll take you back. All right, we're coming to the green, so everyone's still out there. Power is just a lap down. Last. This car's heading in. Here we go. <sighs> green flag. Green, green, green. Back underway. How many drivers able to clear 21 before turn one? Uh, looks like it's gonna be four three. Okay, now it's four drivers. Got right by at least. And the drivers up top, drivers on the bottom. Everyone's going all over the place. Watch it. Matt Daly almost got tumped, dumped by the 27 right there. Again, awfully close. They hung on. Still three wide, three wide, four wide maybe, four wide. Nope, not even close contact. Wow, and they made it. First lap completed under green. First Kyle leads it still. Rogers looking for the lead still. Top two since same since the start of the race. Side by side. Here we go. Both drivers already have won once. Take up problems in the zeros. And whoa, trouble! Car down there. Who's that? That's 31. Safely comes back onto the track. No problems there. Sam Rogers clears. Whoa, look at this! And whoa, there they go. There they go. There they go, right in front of traffic, hard contact. Three cars, four maybe, no, just three, just three. And my God, big wreck, really big. 
Took out a lot right there. Caution is out for the second time. Sam Rogers the leader. We'll take a look at the replay. Tristan Parker in the 89. No patience there. Took out Mason Powers, of course, the lap car. Took himself out and the 68. Both those drivers receive a lot of damage. Watch this. Aureus slammed right into him and he also goes upside down. Right on top of Parker and he flips over. Look at how high that 68 goes. Into the grass and barrel rolls on its nose. And back on its wheels. And watch Parker in the 89 also flip right over. How many times did he flip? Look at how high that 68 is. And then he gets a little bounce right there. Look at the one. He almost went upside down. Did a couple rolls. And there's the four. My god. Hard hit. Still can't catch a break for Warriors, but he's still but he's doing better than what he did in the cup. Lots of drivers that were from the cup doing much, much better. And somewhere in the championship hunt. But look at that. Four just topples right over. Goes over once. And looks like he was about to get saved, but then nope. 31 came in and flipped him right back over. Did another roll and came to a complete stop next to the wall. Look at that 68. My god. Charlotte always has the most ridiculous air when it comes to car. When the cars start to flip and all that stuff. At least all three of them uh, landed back on all four wheels. We'll take you back to the restart. Sam Rogers up front. So he's still leading, I should say. So we're left with 29 drivers. Everyone else is out for an accident, but the one with the camshaft. Gotta be all special and stuff. Oh, period. I don't know, never mind. Joking. Pace car's already in, here we go. Green flag. Back underway. There's the slow cards. Wonder if they're gonna be in effect. Yeah, most likely. If we like have long green flag runs and the leaders catch up. 17 back up front. We only have two leaders. That's a 17 and a 99. But May could be changing. Up the change soon with the 57. Right there to the inside. Emily Brooks in the 50s. Trying to sneak under. Whoa! Sideways off the corner. Kevin Carter will lead this lap. Emily Brooks in the 50 up the second. Metro Riggs in the 36 is up the third. Going for second. Well, Washer's trying to sneak right under him. Whoa, the 52 had his tires on the white line. That was a close one right there. Three wide. Three wide contact. Lots of contact. Whoa, there goes Rogers. Three wide. Three wide for second. Three wide for second. Oh, did a lot of contact. Too much contact, and they hang on. Chris Washer in the five trying to win this race with like having the win stolen from Josh Rodelio in the 12. Gonna try it again tonight. First of the season, hoping hoping for it. Oh boy. They're really trying to pass each other. Every chance they get, they're racing like it's the last lap. I'm surprised they haven't wrecked again, but that could happen soon. Yeah, they're not gonna make it this time. No way. Watch it. One driver's gonna at least spin. Oh, there they go. Nope. Four wide. Back to three, contact, whoa, put the zero right in the wall. And the eight's on the apron, 26 was loose, oh, whoa, whoa, trouble, there goes the 11 and the 15. They kind of saved it, but we're, st we're still green, we're still green. Wow, what a save by those two, uh, oh, now the caution comes out, we got a wreck at the back stretch. Or, no, actually, it's just a spin, Emily Brooks just got turned around, race it back to the line. Patrick Mew in the 52, looks like he's going to take the lead, or, yeah, he's going to take it. Comes with a caution flag. He leads it. We'll take a look at the replay. I want to take a look at this first. I was surprised they didn't call the caution for this, but Eric Powers came up on Ryder Smith, and that was enough sideways to have caution call. Oh, enough sideways? What the hell? Well, at least we're if we're at Michigan. But the 50. Okay, right there. Rewind that. Nearly four wide and 27 forced her up, and she goes. 180 actually no goes a wait no was sideways and almost went fully side all the way around 
But that is what brought out the caution instead of those two drivers that wrecked. That was just a spin. So, yeah, we'll take you back. We're coming to the green here. Still got 29 drivers left. Patrick Mew, Sam Rogers, and Carter Green, your top three. So, pace car is in. Here we go. Still got a lot of cars out there. I'm surprised. This late in the race. Well, not really late. But yeah, you know what I mean. Green flags back out. Rogers. Whoa. What a. Wow. He, he really want to get past Patrick New, or he's just really aggressive. He got a real fast car tonight. He went up to the outside, back to the inside, outside, and back to the inside, and finally made the move. But he doesn't have the fastest lap of the race. That's a 12 who won Darlington. Who is sitting in... I don't know where he is. Oh, there he is. Crossed the line at 18th last time. Whoa, look out the contact. Watch it. Whoa, more. Close call again. Rogers in 99. Back up front. Really fast car. Gotta be the fastest. How fast is he? Who is the fastest lap? No, I mean, I'm not fast up. Where does he even sit? 19th. Wow. Man, that car is really wheeling it. And here comes Kevin Carter for the lead. Oh, trouble. Car in the wall. And more car. The leaders have spun it right out. Oh, my God. And I think Rogers got the lead. Yes, he did. Oh, got double wreck, double wreck, double wreck. Oh, my God. Oh, they're still going. They're still going. Caution is out. Lead the race leader, Sam Rogers. We'll take a look what happened. We have more. The turn is blowing up. All right, let's take a look what happened. Well, let's take a look at the first wreck. The first car I saw spun around. That looks like it's Jesse Turner in the 47. Oh my God, what a hit! Takes the zero out, and John Amandi in the 43 got some as well. And wow, if this was for the win, I say that a lot because you know, if that was for the win. That would be pretty exciting. Look at these drivers. They're all over the place. They're wrecking and rolling. Kyle had to check up and he was, I thought he was going to get the lead there because Roger was like near the wall. But wow. Look how close this was. Imagine that. So close to the wall. And he hit the wall too. And wait, did he? I don't know. Well, yeah, he did. He did. He did hit the wall. Man, Carter took a hard hit right there. Well, good thing there's a safer barrier though. And I think Matt Dalio. Yep, Matt Dalio went upside down. That's the hit from um, Jesse Turner, and right there, Blaine Keys and all that. And here comes more with Marine Keys and Eric Powers. Man, they just kept ramming into each other. John Amandi in the 43 received a lot of damage by running at the back of Mitchell Riggs. Right there. Wow. And there's more big hits. Hmm. You know, Blank Keys, I don't know where he sits on the points, but, you know, he hasn't been doing super well like he did in the beginning. So, I'll have to check with that later. We'll take you back. Alright, here we go. 23 drivers left. Sam Rogers, Chris Kyle, and Henry Powers, your current top three. Here we go. Green flag. Max Titan to the outside, all the way to the outside. Even with one with the with one win in the season, he has not done so well in the others. And the 17 and the 99, these guys are keep on switching spots. How many times have been they passed each other? I don't know, but three wide for second. Here we go. The six of Peyton Keys getting a big run, really big run. Whoa, watch it! Oh, the 20 slid right up, and wow, he was sideways and all that. That was close. How he hung on to that? I don't know how. But he did. He hung on to it. Kept on going. 16 is in the cup back up. Well, in the front. So this could be a good point stay as long as nothing happens. But we still got a long way to go. Still a lot of, a lot of time to make things happen and stuff. 3 wide. 3 wide. Here we go. Here we go. Contact. Hey, hang. They hung on again. Washer is still second. That was for the that was for the win. Uh, saying it again. 
So there he is. Hayden up in the eight car, up the second. You another driver with one win, but having a somewhat of a terrible season. Really deep in the standings, and pretty much probably never got up to the top 20 area. Maybe in the beginning, but whoa, watch it! Oh, there goes the 20, the six. Lots of cars. Oh boy. Points leaders involved, and and they just keep on going. Caution. Caution is out. Eight car Hayden is the leader. Whoa, whoa, watch it. They're swerving all over the place. Get a couple spots before crossing the line. Here we go. So Hayden the leader. We'll take a look at the replay. Brandon was about to take the lead till he got turned by the 22. Flat out dumped him and then collected the paint. Keith Washer also got turned right before he made contact with those two. Rogers, Kyle, Nick, Henry Powers, Kevin Carter, Carter Green, Austin Mongold, Hayden Powers, Michael Dalio. Yeah, Michael Dalio, Ryder Smith. And not a big wreck, but a big pileup though. Okay, medium pileup, not really that big. We'll take you back. And we're back underway. Just somewhat kind of a little bit delayed late it. Made it. Hayden up front, here's Jennifer Dalio. Another driver with one win, but had a terrible season. And three of those drivers with one win and sitting deep in the points are right there. All three of them, top three, that, you know, have that win. Jennifer trying to go for a second. That's tightening 29 to the bottom, Emily Brooks in the 50. Still looking for that first win of the season that's come close a few times. There's the rest of the drivers who have pretty much- Whoa! No contention! Look at that! 12 car! Sideways and he saved it! That's amazing! Here comes a zero running up on the 27 now. He's trying to get as much spots as possible. Because you know, he's racing for championship. I don't even know- I don't even, I don't even remember two of them. Two championship contenders. And Eric Powers is slow as well as another- Oh, they must have wrecked. Riggs in the 36 as well. He is slow. So, six laps to go. At the five car battle for the win. Joe Roberts. Two out of the five cars in this little pack and whoa, whoa, Roberts around. He spins. And the caution is out for that? You've got to be kidding me. No way there could be a caution for something that simp that not dangerous. It's not even dangerous. And Emily Brooks takes the lead, and I think that's it. The race will end under yellow. I think. We'll take a look at the replay. And Joe Roberts got to be pissed off now. Hayden was all over him. And someone finally dumped. And look at that car. It was all sideways. And Hayden, he just kept pushing and pushing. And he just dumps the 22. And he's on the back stretch, on the apron. Didn't hit anything. And still, the yellow comes out. I don't understand. I really don't understand. We have a car in the wall wrecking sideways. No caution. We have a car fully around, doesn't hit anything, is on the apron, and the caution comes out. That's dumb. I don't know. Well, I think we have time. I'll go see if we do. I knew it. I knew it. I counted the laps. I knew it. I knew we were going to go back green. So, two one lap shootout races in a row. Incredible. Will second place steal the win or will the leader hang on? This is for the win. Better make your move now. Here we go. Don't jump. No, I mean, don't spin him. Green flag and a better start for the 25 to the outside. I don't think you want to use the outside lane. Gonna get Fright Train right here. Jennifer trying to go back to the bottom, but Max Titan's already there. That's what Brooks wanted to see. Big mistake on the 25's part. But a 29 and the 8, they're pushing. They're pushing on the back stretch, trying to stick your nose in, and he does. Trouble at the back. Kevin Carter has been wrecked. Brooks loses it. Hayden right there on the bottom, taps the 29. Coming to the checkered flag. Who's it going to be? It's going to be Max Titan. He will win at Charlotte. He got it. Second win of the season. And the wreck at the end puts Kevin Carter, looks like, 18th. 18th, I believe. 18th. 18th? 19th? No, wait, no, no. Oh, yeah, 12 is a lap down, so yeah, that puts him in 18th. 
And Max Titan steals the win. All thanks to Hayden. Give him a little shove. He gets second. Third was Jennifer. Fourth was Brooks. Fifth was Henry Powers. Oh, boy. Well, let's take a look at the full race results. So, Max Titan, Hayden, Jennifer DeLeo, Emily Brooks, Henry Powers, Sam Rogers, Chris Kyle, Jacob Robinson, Chris Washer, and Hayden Powers. Your top 10. 19 jars finished the race. Here's the rest of the race results. We'll now take you to victory lane.